of us. Time for another What's in Wanda's Work Basket. Um, thank you for joining me at Wanda's Work Basket for all things creative and crafty with a little bit of inspiration mixed in, hopefully. Um, before we get started, do all the things, you know, like and subscribe. Hopefully, um, when you read, when you watch this, I've already reached 1,000 subscribers. I'm so close, guys. I'm so close. Please click that subscribe bell so that we can get to 1,000 and I can do that giant giveaway I've been talking about. And we're going to do it live. Uh, and it'll just be, it'll be, excuse me, it'll be loads of fun. So anyway, today I have an unwrapping for you from Diamond Painting Shop. Okay, I got this because it was, I got this off of Facebook. Um, I didn't have a whole lot of expectations for it, but yet I thought I'd give it a try. Maybe you've seen it. Uh, it's a butterfly, diamondpainting-shop.com. It's a very colorful butterfly. There are 23 colors. On the sides, it gives you the sequence number, it gives you the symbol, and it looks like they're one, two, threes, A, B, C's, so there's no, no wacky symbols in there. Uh, and it gives you the color code number on here, the A, B color code. It's, uh, it looks like it's a DMC number with the letter A behind it. Okay. I'm going to show you the thumbnail here. Hard to see, isn't it? Yeah. And let's open the little baggie that comes with it. It comes in a nice, like a flannel baggie. The toolkit. What just comes in the toolkit? I haven't checked it out yet. Oh, cool. Okay. We get the typical pink pen with the brass tip. A blue squishy, Ooh. a curved tweezers with the sharp point on them, see the sharp point and the curve, and it looks like there's like a little finger indentation on it too, isn't that cool? Okay, it comes with multi-placers, looks like I have a two a four, a thick four, and a skinny like six or seven. I don't know, does it have a number on it? I don't have my glasses on. No, it doesn't have a number on it. But it's a large multi-placer. It comes with a little white boat or tray. It comes with a small set of baggies. It looks like everything is in baggies in here anyway. Okay. It comes with goop and this cute little purple gem. You might want to just glue a magnet on the back of that and use it as a cover minder. That's what I like to do with them. And I have um, cover minders at my Etsy shop, Wanda's Work Basket at Etsy.com. Let's see, this comes with five little plates of wax. Little round plates of wax to refill this little diamond here. The wax in them in a certain color, like four different colors. And I put a, uh, a magnet on the back to use them as cover minders. That way they can hold your cover back and you have the wax readily available should you need it. And there's one more thing in this pretty little kit. Can't wait to show you here. Give me some washi tape. Isn't that cool? It's got a an ombre purple with like gold symbols on it. Isn't that pretty? Thank you very much, Diamond Painting Dash Shop .com. And this says it's a premium toolkit. All right, now to look at the drills, and they are all ABs, guys. Divas, they are all ABs. Now let's see. Let's 
here is the page with them on, the picture. And it comes with the sequence number, the symbol number, the DMC number, and the quantity in, okay, in two different uh, languages. It gives you instructions on how to diamond paint, in case you do not know. And if you really don't know, hang around Wanda Work Basket, and poke around to different, uh, different videos, and I have lots of introductory how to do it on here. These are beautiful. Look at the deep colors of the ABs. Oh, they sparkle. Man. All right. 550A. Let's see. Just to make sure that we have... Uh, yes. 550A is the letter F. So not only is... Oh, it, okay. It has a sequence number here. It has the DMC number on it, and it has the weight and the quantity, and it says AB on it. It says 40 by 40, that's what the size is. Um, I don't see a kit number. No, it just says 40 by 40 AB. I don't see a kit number on it. What I would do is um, put a little round sticky on it, and just write the symbol. It looks like they're all numbers and letters. Yes, all numbers and letters. So I would write that on a sticky on this if I were using just the baggies and then it's all kitted up. No need to worry about anything. You can also, I like to put these in um, dollar store trays that have like dividers in them. Then you can put like five at a time in each section or however many you can fit in each section. If I'm going to use the baggies the way they are, I like to put them in containers and label the containers. So I will probably blow this up, like um, get a copy of this and increase the size so that I can have a set of uh, symbols that I can glue right on. Okay, and I'm going to keep this in with the drills. Oh my gosh, these colors are just gorgeous. Look at this, look at this pinks, orange, it's all the colors of the rainbow in here, and the blacks are like the peacock black that have the green and yellow and blue in them. Red, yellow, orange, blue. Oh, I just don't see green, which is all right, I guess. You can imagine the green, huh? I have these, a light purple, Okay, well, this is kind of a teal green, isn't it? Ah, <laughs> oh, bright pink. Beautiful, beautiful. And a dark navy blue. This is going to be gorgeous, guys. This is going to be beautiful. I've done one that's all crystals before, and um, I liked it, except that the all crystals, that's all you see. It takes away the, um, the individuality of... It was like an aquarium thing, and you can't see the little fishies uh, really well because it's all glistening. It's all like shiny, sparkly. Uh, with ABs and this type of thing, I think with the butterfly, it can all be sparkly. It's one big picture, so I don't have any uh, qualms about doing an all AB picture like this. Nice and sticky. Nice and sticky. Alright. Any of the wrinkles you see in the plastic comes off because it's just in the outer covering. It is not in the glue itself. Oh, that's beautiful. Yep. Perfectly flat. It is poured glue, which is the way I like it. I like the plastic covering. Not everybody likes the plastic covering. You can get release papers to put over top of it instead of the plastic covering. And they're small enough that it's like, okay, if you want to do a section at a time, you just pick up one of those release papers and just do that section. But I like to see what, what I'm doing. I like to see how much I've done, how much I have yet to go. There we go. That's fine. All right, and it lies flat really easily. 
you know what? DiamondPainting-Shop.com. I like it. I like it a lot. I'm looking forward to doing this. Um, I can't say that all the time that I like everything I find on the internet, but um, but I'm really liking this. I'm digging it. All right, divas. Thank you for joining me, and I'll see you next time. Bye.